Since the 1870s, one of the most popular defensive firearms has been the side-by-side -side shotgun with short barrels. In the Old West, it was the firearm of choice for lawmen, outlaws, and civilians. In this segment, we're going to look at a modern rendition of this classic fighting firearm. Welcome back to Davidson's Gallery of Guns. In this segment, Doug Howard of Peterson's Hunting Magazine is joining us once again, and he is here to tell us all about the USSG MP220 side-by-side -side shotgun. Welcome, Doug. Thank you, Anne Marie. So before we go into all the details of this great shotgun, let's talk a little bit about the history. Yeah, well, you know, the side-by-side -side shotgun, uh, which a lot of people just commonly refer to as the double barrel. When you say double barrel, that's what they think of more so than an over-under. It has a great history harkening back to the days of the Old West. Uh, a lot of people are familiar watching the westerns uh, as a kid where the stagecoach rider had his guard next to him always carried the double barrel and fighting off the bad guys and keeping the people and the, the, the money safe and uh, you know in fact to even a day when you have a big group of people and they're trying to get in the car and that one person wants that front seat to get holler <laughs> I'm riding shotgun you know and uh, a lot of people don't realize that's sort of where that statement came from you know and uh, so we have the double barrel shotgun to thank for that. I never get shotgun. <laughs> never. Okay, so uh, explain to our viewers out there why this would be a great shotgun for defensive purposes, and well, still is today. Well, absolutely. Uh, the number one reason is simplicity. I mean, more so than the pump and even a semi-auto, you know, the user has to do something to engage and, and take the gun to battery. This gun's loaded. It's ready to go. No matter how much time we shoot at the range, most of us are never going to be trained well enough to be in that situation to where our nerves are just going to be, you know, cool as steel. You know, we're going to be nervous, a uh, little bit like I get on TV sometimes, <laughs> you know. And, and that means mistakes can happen. You may overlook something that's critical. With this, it minimizes what you have to worry about. You simply point the gun. A lot of times those double barrels are going to be so intimidating, that's going to be enough. But if you do have to fire, all you do is click the safety and pull the trigger. And speaking of trigger, can you walk us through the second trigger on this shotgun? Sure. The two triggers historically is a feature of this type of gun. However, shooters of over and unders, which are also a type of uh, double barrel shotgun, a more common type today, especially among competitive shooters, a lot of them will be more familiar with seeing just a single trigger. Well, that's because those guns use a selector switch, which help the user decide which barrel they want to fire first. The only problem with that is if the first barrel doesn't fire for some reason, say you got a bad shell in there, something just goes wrong, it doesn't switch and you can't fire that second barrel, rendering your gun inoperable. That's just unacceptable in a defensive situation where you don't have time to reload. With this gun, the two triggers, each trigger operates a barrel. So if for some reason you have a misfire in one barrel, you just pull the second trigger and you're in business. Also in a hunting situation, while this gun's a little shorter than what most hunters are going to want to use, it could be used for that because uh, it does come with three choke tubes, a full modified and improved cylinder. In those situations, you might uh, put a full choke in one barrel and an improved cylinder for another, a full choke for further away shots, the improved cylinder for closer shots. And depending on your shot presentation, you can decide which barrel you want to fire first. Now, Doug, can you tell us all about the other great features of this gun? Sure, it's a great looking little shotgun. I was really excited to see it on the show. Um, you know, to me, there's a few things that have more classic styling than a nice side-by-side -side double yeah. barrel. It's a 20 gauge, as we mentioned. It's chambered for both two and three quarter and three inch shells. Uh, it's a nice compact gun. The overall length is really short, courtesy to the 20 inch barrels. It makes it easy to maneuver through a house, uh, you know, and checking things or store in a, in a tr car or truck or in a compact space in your home. Uh, it's got the rear tank safety, simply slide forward and you're ready to fire. It's got a beautiful walnut stock and fore end with a nice cut checkering. And this checkering not only looks beautiful, but it also helps aid the grip. It's also a cast-off stock, which means the, the rear of the stock actually cants a little bit, so when you put your cheek to it, your eye better aligns down the sighting plane of the gun for a right-handed shooter. It's a great little defensive shotgun and really a fun gun to shoot. Absolutely. The MP220 is fast into action, easy to use, and reliable, which makes it a great choice for all of you out there who are searching for a defensive firearm.